Hello everyone, welcome back again to Mufasuke channel. Today we are going to create a simple floor plan with a LibreCAD software. Okay, open your LibreCAD application and in it I will hide code. You can click this code icon. You can click option and go to current drawing preference. I will change units. We can use millimeter or you can use uh, your uh, units. You can click OK to apply. The next you can active this uh, windows. It will be appear dialog box in the left or uh, drawing area. And also you can active this object snap. But first I will use only this uh, snap and point. You can click line tools and you can create a vertical line. So I will create in here with length about 4000. Click at this point. You can use uh, scroll mouse to zoom in and zoom out. And you can press scroll mouse to use pen. Okay, this is for pen. This is for zoom in and zoom out. I will create horizontal line okay, with length about 5000. Click at this point. We create again vertical lines 5000. Click at this point. The next, uh, sorry, uh, for our vertical lines, we can set into minus 5000. And here we can set minus and click at this point. And now we create again for uh, horizontal minus 3000. Click at this point. The next we can use uh, two points and click in here. You can use a vertical option, click at this point. And now in active, click at this point. You can press escape button to close the comment. Okay. Now uh, we can create a line in here with uh, vertical lines with uh, lengths in here. I will set into 2000. Click in here and I will create line to point. Okay, you can active this option, click at this point, and now you can press shift button, move into here, click. You can press escape to close. Okay, we created this uh, simple sketch. You can click here to save, and I will save in here into it a sample correct floor plan. You can click save. Now uh, we can offset this uh, all lines object. You can select uh, this uh, lines, offset lines, and click offset tools. You can offset with this 10, 120. You can click inside. Okay. Then escape button to close. We offset again. These are uh, two lines objects. With this 10, 120, click at this point, and you can close. Okay. You can use the fillet tools to connect between these two objects right here. Fillet and radius zero. Click these objects and also click in here. So it will be automatically fillet. You also can fillet cut at this point. Corner. Okay, we fillet in here. Okay, we fillet again in the bottom. Make sure you select uh, this line, okay, we fillet at this point. Fill again in here. Okay, at this point. Okay, the next in here we can use uh, trim tools. Okay, you can click here, trim. And we can select for cutting, I will select uh, in here. We cut at this point, cut in here, okay, and then cut at this point. In here, we can use a cut tool, so you can press or type cut and press enter with this line objects, cut from this point, okay, you can active uh, this two option and point, click in here. Okay, select this uh, line object again and click at this point. Now we can close the command and you can select in here, you can press delete button. So it will be uh, delete. In here you also can use uh, trim tools. Click here, trim, select uh, these objects and we cut in here. Cut again at this point. 
and now in here we can use cut command can tell cut press enter select this uh, line objects okay we cut in here select again this line objects and we cut at this point you can select this object and you can press delete button so uh, we already create uh, this uh, simple floor plan now uh, i will create a uh, door layer but first uh, we can click save you can click here to add new layers and you can set into door you can change color in design and you can click ok ok we can create line with uh, these tools so vertical ok i will active this option create in here but first i will set length into 120 ok this for 120 we can use uh, offset this uh, line objects with uh, offset distance 40 click in here now use uh, two points to create a line from this point into here okay the next from this point into this point you can press a shift button to close we create vertical again vertical lines with length 900 Okay, now uh, we can use uh, offset tools with uh, offset is 10 minus 20. You can click at this point, use a uh, two point again, and I will create line with red lines in here. Okay, now we can use the arch command in here, center point angle, center point at this point, and click at this point. Now we can click in here. The last we can click at this point so it will be correct arch you can select uh, these objects press uh, ctrl plus c to copy click here for base point and then you can press ctrl button plus v to paste at this point okay now we already correct uh, this uh, simple door layer i will convert uh, this door into block you can click here block list and you can select this object you can click in here to correct block and i will click at this point so we give name block name into door you can click ok so we have uh, this door if you delete this object you also can insert by right click at this point and you can click insert block so it will be insert like you can insert in here and you can close okay you can insert again you can insert block at this point i will uh, inactive this option uh, sorry uh, we can inactive here click at this point and here we can use a uh, mirror tools you can select the object click uh, mirror command okay start from this point into here use a uh, delete originals and you can click ok so it will be mirror. Now we can use move tools to move uh, these objects. Click in here. Okay, move into this point with angle zero. You can click OK. So it will be moved. Okay, you can uh, go to layer list. If you click this uh, option, it will be height for a door. You can click again to unhide. Okay, uh, now uh, we can correct a uh, two point line. You can click at this uh, layer okay i will create two point line from this point to here we create again from this point to here then next uh, from this point into here and now from this point into here okay you can uh, click this option to hide the door layer so it will be create line at this point in here we can use uh, trim command or you can use move for vertex click this uh, vertex and move into here so it will be move from this point into this point you can click and now we can create two point okay i will use uh, vertex moving from this point into this point click from this point into this point and click okay use uh, two point to correct at this point Okay, we create uh, this uh, simple cut in problem. You can click here to unhide again. So we create this door. And now, how to apply heads into this floor plan? 
you need to select uh, this all objects okay this uh, closing objects like uh, polygon objects and now you can click this icon H you can click for add step in here for angles or for MC you can uh, add text for enable perfume I will use scaling here into 25 so if we click OK it will be automatically apply in uh, this close objects okay now you can click here to unhide for the now how to create text into this floor plan you can click here to create M text okay, I will set in here into room 1 with height 180 you can click OK and we can place at this point okay we create again for uh, room 2 click at this point the next uh, we create for uh, room 3 okay click at this point so we create uh, this uh, simple room text in a display plan now uh, finally we can apply dimension into this floor plan you can go to option and go to current drawing preference you can click dimension in here i will use a uh, general scales you can set scales into 50 and for color text color i will set into green for accession line i will set into red and also in here into red you can click OK. Okay, and I will apply dimension into this uh, floor plan. So you can click here for dimension tools. Use uh, horizontal dimension. Click in here into this point. And then we can move to the bottom here. We need to use a free snap. Okay, we create again from this point with uh, this option horizontal click at this point okay it's a free snap okay click at this point we create again with end snap in here and use uh, this uh, option okay and free snap or you can use uh, this option click at this point okay i will uh, change uh, in here into zero you can click option go to current dimension and for precision into zero click ok click right again for vertical dimension and point okay you can click in here for uh, end point user free snap Okay, you can select uh, these objects and we can move from this point into here. In here, we can active for this option. Okay, we can put again this uh, vertical dimension from this point, and we can use uh, this option and point and click at this point okay it's free snap and click in here okay we create again into here free snap don't forget to use free snap and point and uh, this option okay we create for uh, horizontal in here free snap The next at this point, we create a vertical. This a free snap. Okay, we create again vertical from this point. Use uh, this option vertical in here. Free snap and click at this point. Okay, the last we create from this point into this point use a free snap okay we already created uh, this uh, simple uh, 2d floor plan with uh, libercat software 
and if you have any question about these uh, tutorials you can comment below this video